you all. <coughs> I'm sick. ago Judd got sick and I immediately called my immunologist and asked her what we should do and she said <coughs> stick to the usual protocol no physical contact with Judd do not share drinks or food or towels sleep in separate rooms and we did that but <coughs> we do that every time he gets sick but of course I got sick so when I started feeling the symptoms of the cold I just went to the pharmacy and got some over-the-counter cold medication and I thought I was gonna be okay <coughs> but then suddenly things got a lot worse and so I went to the doctor and got a sinus infection and the start of an upper respiratory infection these things with me very quickly turn into bronchitis or pneumonia <coughs> I was very determined to not let that happen so I've been started they put me on a course of antibiotics. Today, I take my last dose of that course. I have not gotten any better. So I'm going to be starting a different antibiotic and do another course. <coughs> but I talked to my immunologist and she did give me some good news. Because I've come so far in my immunotherapy and it's been so effective, <coughs> um, getting sick will not be as detrimental as it would have been in the past. It'll still be harder for me because no matter what treatments we do, I'm still going to have a faulty immune system, but my body <clears throat> should be able to manage it better. It's frustrating to be sick like this, but if I'm being honest with myself, only having a sinus infection and, you know, the start of an upper respiratory is pretty good because by now, I would have already had bronchitis and um, <coughs> it would have been much worse, so... don't feel good. You know, <clears throat> I call it getting normal people sick. Like my body's already in a constant battle with my chronic illnesses. So to add in like sickness on top of that, just like insult to injury. I feel like people with chronic illness should be exempt from getting normal people <laughs> sick, but it is what it is. You know, everyone has to deal with it. And um, it does complicate things for me health wise. <coughs> 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 So of course it's hard because of my immunodeficiency. But then my asthma starts to act up. With the Zoller shots, my asthma has gotten really well under control. But when I get sick like this, um, I have to go back on my maintenance inhaler that I take morning and night. Typically I, I don't need that anymore because <clears throat> of the Zoller, um, but <laughs> I need it when I'm like this. And I have to use my rescue inhaler more often. And then because my mast cell disease is tied into my immune system <clears throat> when my immune system is on the fritz like it is now my mast cell disease does become a bit more temperamental <clears throat> and i'm more sensitive to triggers like a uh, cigar and, and and cigarette smoke <clears throat> <clears throat> and then of course there is the uh the fatigue and um my, my pain gets worse and it's just <laughs> because I have a central line, I do have to watch for fevers, um, but you know, I just <clears throat> follow my doctor's orders, take my medicine. So I'm doing another round of antibiotics, taking cold medicine. I'm doing salt gargles. My mom makes me this like ginger, honey, lemon tea. And uh, I did have to start some oral steroids because <clears throat> um, it's just, just for my asthma. <clears throat> so yeah. <clears throat> Judd got me sick, but <laughs> I'm proud of my body for doing better this time and I'm just gonna <coughs> do the best I can to get over the sickness, especially with family coming into town and the, the holidays coming up. <clears throat> Anyways, speaking of the holidays, I'm gonna have a holiday sale on the Chronically Jackie merchandise store. So if you wanna look in the description, I'm gonna put a discount code there for 20% off <coughs> and it'll be valid until December 31st. And 
<laughs> I also want to say thank you so much. On the video yesterday about Oakley's passing, um, it's been a few days now and <laughs> it's, it's still hard, but we're moving forward, we're processing, and I just want to say thank you so much for the support. Y'all, your condolences and love and encouragement means a lot to us. <clears throat> oh, I also want to say, I don't like clickbait. <clears throat> I actually, I didn't know what that was until at the beginning of this year, even though I've been blogging for a few years now. <clears throat> I don't like it. I think it's, what's the word? Um, dishonest, I mean, I'm not dishonest. I just, I don't think it's done like in good character. I do not use clickbait. At least I don't think I do and I don't attempt to. So yesterday when I uploaded that video about Oakley passing, <laughs> I was worried people would think it's about Harlow. So I tried everything I could to make sure, you know, it's not about Harlow. I put family pet, not service dog. I said family, not like my dog, <laughs> even though, you know, Harlow is part of the family. I made sure in the thumbnail, Harlow was visible there. Um, she's, you know, <coughs> alive here. <laughs> and um, I also, um, <clears throat> in the thumbnail, I put like a picture of Judd and Oakley and I kind of like in the corner, like a thought bubble, like that's who I'm remembering. And then I also put in bold letters in the thumbnail, missing Oakley. So <clears throat> if y'all had a mini heart attack thinking it was Harlow, I apologize. I really tried to make sure that didn't happen. And of course, like, <clears throat> it's still a heavy loss with Oakley, but I hope y'all understand what I'm trying to say. I just, I'm not feeling very well, so. Anyways, <clears throat> that's what I'd say. I'm sick, it affects my body differently because I'm chronically ill, but I am strong and I will get through it. <laughs> we have the holiday sale on the Chronically Jackie store, so just check the description for the discount code if you wanna take advantage of that. And thank you for your support, as always. <coughs> Judd's like perfectly fine now, by the way. <laughs> he got out, he was sick, got over it super quick, and now I got it, but. <clears throat> Anyways, with that, I will say goodbye, and thanks for joining us on my adventure.